Okay, uh, I have tried to attach the uh, this tea adapter, Canon tea adapter, to to my uh, Square Watcher ST eighty millimeter, and now I've tried to attach it to the Square Watcher ST uh, one hundred twenty millimeter. A surprise, surprise, just removing the, or just removing the diagonal, the, uh, T adapter, easily, Canon D adapter, T adapter, easily fits there. So I'm really delighted with this, it's just, I just can immediately use this as an astrophotography, telephoto zoom, zoom lens. My camera will be just attached to this. Okay, this is my new setup. This is my Canon Astro Modified uh, EOS 100D, and this is a Sky Watcher 120. And uh, I've taken my first uh, image. I'll show you now. Okay, let's go to watch that image. Okay, that's my first image taken with this setting, three seconds, and ISO was uh, 3000, I think, and I will continue to take more images. As you can see, this is the image I've taken now, and you can see the extent of the nebula visible now. And this is now 12,000, uh, ISO 12,000. Sorry, I told the previous image uh, was 12,000, no, the previous image was 6,400. This one is 12,800. And you can see the brightness in this screen. And uh, the detail is amazing, I like that. The amount of the nebula has been different. Let me, I don't see any light being actually failed. Okay, this one is two and a half uh, second uh, and uh, ISO is 6400. I must say I never had such a comfort doing astrophotography. So I'm carrying on this this setup using a five inch telescope as a telephoto lens really works well. Just I needed just one single uh, T adapter T mount. Really good. I see a lot of nebula. Probably I should process this further later. Okay, this was my first session of the astrophotography using a telescope as a zoom lens. Here you see the star Al Nitak, and uh, at the center here you see Sigma Orionis, and uh, I can see the nebulosity around the Al Nitak. So that's a good sign. Uh, it's not more than two seconds that I've exposed this. So. I'm really pleased with the result. Some of the pictures are really better than the others, as you may see here. So, I'm looking forward to um, upload this video and just, uh, uh, yeah, see how it will be, if I can process some of them to show a little bit more details, probably I would do. Other than that, this kitchen windowsill is really serving well. It's a cold night, of course. And uh, using a 5-inch refractor as a telephoto lens has worked.